Start by blow drying your hair from root to finish. This look is actually ideal for a second or third day of a blowout. So if your hair is already dry, you just want to distribute your natural oils through your hair evenly. Using Redken Smooth Lock Heat Glide, pour a quarter size amount in your hand and run it through the ends of your hair using a Mason Pearson brush to distribute it evenly. Next we will apply an oil to our roots. You can even use coconut oil if you want, but today I chose the Schwarzkopf Bonicure Hair Oil. Take sections of your hair starting in the back and generously apply to the root. If you're using coconut oil, be careful, a little bit goes a long way. The trick with this hairstyle is to have the root greased up while your ends remain shiny but not overly saturated. Go ahead and continue this motion throughout your hair. Once we have evenly applied root oil, we will section off the hair below the occipital bone and begin to flat iron the hair. Use a comb to guide the hair so you get out the tangles and the iron glides easily over the hair. Make sure to get through the ends to really seal them. Go through section by section. You can do bigger sections and start from the mid shaft so your hair doesn't get too flat. We really want to focus on sealing the ends. When we are done with the back, move to the front and the sides. It's easiest to use horizontal sections on the side, again using bigger 2-3 to three inch sections, and beginning from the mid shaft. Once you're finished, continue on to the other side and repeat.
Next, we're gonna cocktail Kevin Murphy's Treatment Oil and Redkin's Super Strong Sculpting Gel. Apply to the root and midway down, creating the shape that you prefer. Make sure to be generous with the gel in your mix and keep it on the top section of your hair. When the desired shape is achieved, use your Mason Pearson brush to distribute the product evenly and smooth out the kinks. Finally, spray a little shine mist all over your hair. We love the Kevin Murphy's Shine Mist and enjoy your wet look, Dame.